<sighs> I'm sick. Like what? I've had four different people working on my crash in the last week trying to get this thing right. It's too many. Oh, the flares are better. The flares are better. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the hearts are always way better than the flares. Mm. <gasps> If we're here all night, we're here all night. We're here all night, yeah. Great. Honestly, dude. <laughs> I'm feeling good. This is what I call a good night. What's going on? I'm here for you now. What are we doing? What's going on out there in YouTube land? I didn't even get her to go that time. <laughs> <laughs> were you, gonna, were you trying to scare me? A little bit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're here with the one and only Natty Nightheart, Heart Dynasty, WWE Diva Champion, and it, no, not NXT. Uh, Raw D Champion. Diva Champion, SmackDown Women's Champion, Smackdown and champion. a Women's Tag Team Champion. There it is. Like, I get them all mixed up, like, so many belts. <laughs> She's in town today, just came from a show. Uh, a Sunday Stunner, I think it's a new name for these shows, right? Yes. So you guys are on the road, did Las Cruces, Albuquerque, uh, traveling like they always do, 280 days a year. We were on the road a ton. Living the life. Um, so she stopped by, they're a little banged up, she literally just got out of the ring. Um, so we're going to do a little soft tissue work on her, hear about her, her family history in wrestling, um, a little bit about what she's going on, got going on nowadays, and then we'll uh, sell her some crack on the internet. <laughs> that sounds good. And then what's your YouTube, your sister's YouTube channel? <laughs> um, <laughs> it's the Night Hearts. So, yeah. And yeah. you forgot to mention that I'm a three-time Guinness World Record holder. Jeez. Sorry. I'm failing right now. <laughs> three-time Guinness World Record holder. Uh, so make sure to go subscribe to her channel. We'll link that below. Her sister's channel. The Night Hearts. We share it. They, they share it. They totally share it. So if you're looking for gourmet recipes, um, that's Or you're looking to see girls that bounce. Check us out. Oh, I think she sold it right there. All right, let's get rolling. Go ahead, look straight down for me. Ouch. All right, so currently feuding with Ronda Rousey. Uh, what's that like, you know, being in there with a judoku? You know, you've been wrestling for a long time. You have a long family history, you know, history. Right. Throwing sharpshooters on people. Um, it's really intense, to be perfectly honest. Ronda's, like, not a joke. I mean, in every sense of the word, she's as real as it gets, and uh, it hurts. That's why I'm with you right now. <laughs> so you're putting your body through it. I'm really putting my body through it, and uh, it hurts actually to put the sharpshooter on her because she's like a wild wombat. A wombat? <laughs> a wombat's like pretty vicious? Or? They're vicious, wild, moody animals. I don't think we have uh, no Australians in the room. <laughs> Canadian, it's like close. What are you feeling here with my neck? <laughs> We're just working through the soft tissue of that area. Okay. Is it tight? And you're from Calgary, correct? Yes. And you, you came up in the Stampede yep. uh, League. Yep. Oh, I've never had anybody do this. <laughs> back up. Holy shit. And back down again. And so tell me what it was like growing up in a wrestling family. Did you feel pressure to get into it? You talked about like that being something that's in your family. You can't escape. Obviously, you're married to a wrestler. Been around it my whole life. My grandfather had a ring in our yard, a dungeon in his basement. They had a bear living in the basement. We have 13 bear cats. Bear in the basement. Wait, back up on that. Yeah, they had a bear named Terrible Ted living in our basement. He Terrible was Ted. A very sweet little bear that ate, licked ice cream off of people's feet. Aww. Long story. But crazy, crazy wrestling family. Hmm. Been around it my whole life. Okay. And obviously, the namesake, Hart, and uh, the sharpshooter in homage to your uncle, correct? <laughs> <laughs> like what? I can't talk right now. I can't talk. <laughs> what's, well, it been, what's it been like watching the progression of women's wrestling? Because you know, coming been, from the the previous area where you were seeing more broad panty matches, um, I've been didn't through really, so many different eras yeah, of it, in, and it's really cool to see the women being taken more seriously and just being respected for their their skill and their their talent in the ring. Yeah, all, all three ladies here tonight. You know, big time part of the card. The co-main on the left side over here, and then right. in the card. So a pretty big deal. You guys all had really great pops with the crowd. Yeah. Other than Albuquerque, the girl, of course, the girls the always the, the girls always steal the show. I always feel like that. We always steal the show. So when you're doing these house shows and you know you're not on television, does that ever like sap your energy, or do you think you have more fun with the crowd when you're doing? We, that kind I of show? always love doing the live events. It's always the travel. I would do the, I would do my job for free. I get paid to do the travel. Okay. So the travel yeah. is hard. You had to drive from Las Cruces. Yeah. <laughs> and we had. We were in, in like three days, we were in Florida, Connecticut, New Orleans, Baton Rouge, Las Cruces, El Paso, and Albuquerque. And then tomorrow we're back home in Tampa. What are your favorite cities to travel to? Ooh, MSG. I love Australia, Japan. Um, favorite place in the world to wrestle would be... 
Ooh. El Paso. Really? El Paso is one of my favorite places in the world to wrestle. Why is that? The, the fans, they're amazing. Okay, that's because that's what I was gonna ask next. It's the like, home of Eddie Guerrero, for one, but the fans there are just second to none. They're really some of the most special fans in the world. Hmm. Now, did you grow up watching any of like the Luchador matches or any of that kind of stuff? Because it's a different style, obviously, than I grew up watching, what, you, what you were around in Canada. Grew up watching a lot of my family. Okay. So, wow. Because, you know, you talk about these regional scenes. Japan is a little different, you know, some of the, the catch wrestling and things like that. Yeah, but, I grew know. up watching a lot of, a lot of wrestling. Look down oh. to the right. She's like, I, I'm not really answering that question. There's, there's wrestling. The to the right. Damn, this is the deepest tissues massage I've ever had in my life. <laughs> the deepest, deepest, deepest tissues. Right. That's the title. Deepest she's ever gotten. Do I need ice, Advil, or vodka? <laughs> Tilt down to the right. Just don't mix all three. Just pick one. So other than obviously your family, who are some people you grew up watching or wanting to emulate their style? Or um, I love Shawn Michaels, Randy Savage, uh, some Japanese wrestlers, Koji Kanemoto. Um, gosh, I'm just trying to think of some of the ones that I really love. Kenta Kobashi. I, I love, um, I mean, I'm, I'm going to be come right out and say it, but Bret Hart is awesome. Some of his matches have just never like aged. Well, that's what I was just going to ask. I was like, are you allowed to say that you grew up liking Shawn Michaels? I actually, Shawn Michaels was like my very first crush. When I was a little girl, I, I loved the Rockers. <laughs> the dance? The sh when they were the Rockers, my, I was like, Six. had a huge crush on Shawn Michaels. My little sister, like <laughs> Marty Jannetty. We, we would always like watch them wrestle my dad and my uncle. But I feel like after the screw job as a family, it's like, well, are we yeah. good, we're good with that? We're past that now? I don't really know if we'll ever be past. <laughs> That's what I was getting at. <laughs> well, see, I love Shawn Michaels. He's been nothing but wonderful to me. I worked with him a couple weeks ago at NXT. Okay. And he's just like a really, he's a really nice person. He's a great, he, I find him to be a stand-up guy, but, you know, with his situation with my uncle, it's just, it was something between the two of them. So and, so was the actual thing, was it a, was it a, a, a shoot work or was it a, a work work? Oh, or was it was it a as shoot? real as real as real can be. Okay. Because so, there's still speculation to this day. Yeah. Like, well... Well, no, it was as, that was as real as real can be. Okay. But so the heat was, was, was real, real. The, the heat you was were real. really young at the time, right? I was young, and the heat was real, and I think it's one of those things that I know they've moved past it, but I think it, it will always kind of hurt Brett. Like, when he thinks about it, it, it still kind of hurts his soul. Hmm. So who's your favorite opponent you've had over the years? Definitely not Shayna. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, she she really put a yeah I'm just kidding I'm so just kidding I loved working with Jaina I think my favorite favorite opponent ooh I mean somebody I really really loved wrestling uh, I loved wrestling Sasha really really liked wrestling Sasha we had really good chemistry. I really feel like Ronda could be one of my favorite opponents too. We have great chemistry. I, had, I have also extremely good chemistry with Charlotte Flair. But you know, the hearts are always going to be better than the flares. Oh, shots fired across yeah. the bow. Yeah. Shots. Always, fired. Hearts are always going to always be better than the flares. Hmm. And Ronda fears me, but that's all. It's all good. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> Look down into the left. Oh and back. Gina, up. you're going to freak out over this. Back up. Let's what go. are you trying to say? Look down to the left. And back up. And down to the left. We're going to hold right there. Find your happy place. Find that happy place. I feel like you're in El Paso right now. The happiest of places. <laughs> I'm in El Paso. I'm at Chipotle. I'm eating chips and guac. I'm about to go to Starbucks and get a okay, shot. You can't eat Chipotle in El Paso. Think about that chorizo, uh, chorizo. That go. chorizo you gave me earlier that's giving me heartburn? Oh, oh no, it's too spicy for you too? <laughs> oh, these blonde girls. Oh. Oh. What's my next step? Oh, it's getting looser. Okay. Look straight down. Well, Is that a golf course? I can't go any further. And tilt your head to the ceiling. Like and then back down. And then back up. And down. And up. Oh, are you kissing And down. Me? And up and down. Up you can learn some down, cool tricks from these guys. Up, fun. And down. Good. Two more times. Good. <gasps> <laughs> so take this arm, go in Sorry. and out like that. <laughs> and clear yourself, scap out here. Alright, keep moving the arm there. No. 
What are we doing? So you watch CJ's video, then you know it's coming. Oh, no, no. I, I'm i scared. Keep moving your arm. I'm scared, scared for real. No, Shane, I'm a man. You do this. This is like your sick dance move, like this. Shane, I'm a man. There we go. Okay. <gasps> Just get a little closer there. Keep moving your arm. <laughs> okay. Keep moving it. Keep moving I'm keep scared moving. for real. I want my friend to hold my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody hold her hand. <laughs> hold her hand. Hold <laughs> me. Is it gonna? Is it? Is this it? Right. <laughs> That's, that's, all it, right? that's it. That's what we're doing. Yeah. This doesn't hurt. Is it better? Yeah. Good. I'm okay right now. <laughs> <laughs> so go up and down like that. I almost got up. I'm going to need you in a that's minute. That's the one I hate. Okay. The lat? Yeah. The lat. No, the lats are great. I'm I mean, built. You're going you're gonna to cry at yeah, do Dr. Chances too. This is like same stuff he does. Arm goes in and out. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Where did I put it? Move that arm, not their foot. Where? The same way you The same do dance move. One. Boom, boom. The wiggity, wiggity, wild. <laughs> Like you're backhanding me. You're Sheena. Yeah, yeah. Sheena. There you go. You're, uh, 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 the, flare, uh, the flares are better. The flares are better. Oh. Yeah. She said it. She said it. I mean, the hearts are always be better than the flares. Mm. I feel like they missed out on an opportunity to have like a Spades family come in here. I know. You know? I know. That's me. <laughs> there it is. There. She's your huckleberry. Yeah, she is my uncle. That's what our tag team is. The, <laughs> the real flush. The real flush. Up and down. The straight flush. <sighs> Not too bad there. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> is it good? You're good. Good. That first one hurt like a mother f Excuse my language. Bless you. Bless you. Go ahead and your around Lacey Evans too much. I'm so happy I'm never having a child. Because I don't know what that would be like. Same. Same. <laughs> what was was that? Ankle. What, what was there we go. Which groin are you feeling? This one. The right side. That was my hip that came out. Yeah. <laughs> push push across your body this way. To me. Feel anything there? A little bit. Show more? The Magnus? Magnus. <laughs> <laughs> Jana, stop! The that's exactly what it's I'm my Magnus. it's my um. She said like what's she it called? The word it's called my glutey or my my my. Add Dr. Magnus. Add Dr. Magnus. <sighs> Jana. Yeah. Stop. <laughs> Jana, nice to meet you. I also can feel it a lot in my finger that Rhonda fucking hurt. Yeah, he's not gonna adjust your 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 smashed nail. You, that's true. You literally think this is my uh, this is my Dr. Magnus right here. Yeah. Yep. What's going on? Tell me what's You strained it. I strained it. Yeah. I it was doing great until I worked with Rondo again tonight, and I like I just jammed it again. I don't know what I did. Do you feel the strain a little bit? I mean, I feel the tightness for sure. Yeah. So when you strain the muscle, it's going to protect itself by tightening up, and you can just keep restraining it. So I keep. It was totally fine. Like the last two three days, it felt really really good, and I kind of strained it again tonight. Right. My adductor Magnus. That's what's going on. I'm crying. Bating? Yeah. It's my adductor Magnus. <laughs> the Magnus, the Magnus. It is. It is what it is. It's true. <laughs> I'm so freaking sick of this adductor Magnus. You know? <laughs> I'm sick. Like, well, I've had four different people working on my crotch right. in the last week trying to get this thing right. It's too many. Too many cooks in the kitchen. I've had Icy Hot there. I've had THC Bomb. I've had everything else you can imagine. On the Magnus? <laughs> Ice Heat. <laughs> <sighs> yep. Magnus. That's where it is. The Magnus. That's yep. where it is. What do you think that's from? What am I not doing right? Because it wasn't I mean, anything. you throw yourself on the floor for a living. Yeah, yeah. you're gonna strain There's muscles. A lot of yeah. You know, in, in in regular wrestling, like I would always get hurt more being the dummy. Yeah, yeah. Drilling, falling, like not not knowing how to take a bump, essentially, as a amateur wrestler. Like my wrist, my shoulder, you know. Yeah, the little the little stuff. The little falls and. It's the most irritating too, because yep. it's like oh, it's always on the stupid wrist. wrist. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad that you like you can feel it and we're working on it. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. It's good for both of us, I think. <laughs> and more for them, actually. Oh yeah. yeah. The entertainment <laughs> side of it. Exactly. The madness. Exactly. The madness. Because right. it's just it's just a little Pull tight. Again. What? Pull again? Oh yeah, that feels better. Okay. That feels great. Good. I liked what you did. <laughs> I'm the Magnus. Yeah. Oh my god, that feels much better. That's why like, you can't go like sign up for a subscription at the joint. 
Do you know what I mean? Like, yes. you got to find like guys. You got to find people that can dig in deep. Yeah. Yeah. So, so there's like, so I mean, better already. Adjusting and stuff like that. It's it's a skill like shooting a basketball right. or whatever. So anybody could try to make a shot, but there's a big difference between like Steph Curry, and then like Shaq even somebody at a high level. So the size, hand speed, experience, those things all play into it. And it's I like, like it's I not like, like just writing a script where anybody can do it. Yeah, Jaina and Raquel know that when it comes to what I like, I like the Louis Vuitton of whatever it is. <laughs> so just bring on the Louis Vuitton of chiropractors. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, just everybody's body responds that's differently, good, so you just sort of have to find, like, who you vibe with, what your body responds to, and just listen to your body. Yeah. If you have a therapist and you respond well to it, it doesn't matter what it is. Yeah. Stick and, with and that. And I do believe in prehab, not rehab. Sure. If we, we stay on top of our injuries and we keep, you know, like with what we do, it's so physical. It's like people, you know, often say like what we do is fake. It's like, I, it's so hard. It's like even just hitting the ropes will leave Choreographed. you. Choreographed. Like all these broken necks and, and hitting, everything else you want to talk about fake. Hitting the ropes will uh, leave you with old, bruises. Old wrestlers yeah. are significantly more beat up than old fighters. Yeah. As far as joints and... It's just, it's hard. It's like the mat is, hitting the mat's hard, the ropes are hard, the turnbuckles are hard. It's, it's hard. It's more frequent. You know, most of the time you guys are carrying more weight. Yeah. Um, There's less recovery um, time. When you have a fight, you, you, you kill yourself a, for 12 weeks. You take weeks. a couple weeks for like, you have, a, you have your fight and then you get a couple weeks where you're like eating junk food and you get to live a little and then you're like, even when you're back to training, when it's not fight camp, it's like... You know the the research on concussions and stuff is out, so there's not a lot of camps that do hard sparring every right. week like the old school days. So it's like you, you get time in between, but when we're on the road five days a week, mm -hmm. it's it starts just adding up, and it never you know a fight will get make give you this much damage, but you have this much time to get back yep. here. Wrestling will give you this much damage, but you're there forever because yep. you're never coming back down. Again and again and again. Like no. it's it it might not be. You know, you don't have stitches and whatever. Sometimes you do, right? But <laughs> it's it's just constant, and it's the it's like imagine doing like a, like wrestling every day, like you see in the gym here, and then just sitting in a plane as your recovery like this in a seat. On to the next city. And you're like, like, get in the rental car. And then let's you're like, go. Sleep like this. That's the worst part for me. Is like, yeah, I could wrestle all day, but getting off the plane, I'm like, oh, oh shit, I can't. I feel uh, you. Back to the courtyard and get the rental car. Here we yeah. pack up again. Yeah. You guys are tougher than I am for sure. I'm bring you right there. Bring this arm back over. Big deep breath. And I'll blow it out. Oh. <laughs> I like how he's like, oh. Ooh. Oh, I'm I'm so, cool. that felt great. That felt really good. <sighs> yeah, so you're a little stuck right there. C three, four. It's lower. It's like six. Yeah. This is, yeah, it's mostly there. Is that where you feel it? Yeah, a little tight. This feels okay? Yeah. Let's clap. Drop your right shoulder down. <gasps> you still with us? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Oh my god. How's that feel now? I think... <laughs> god, I'm sorry, I just, that was wild. That was wild, what happened? <laughs> we moved the joints on that side. Everything's good though? Yeah. I'm gonna just gonna walk after this. <laughs> so how does that spot feel? Does it still good. feel tired right there? It feels, it feels good. Everything feels good. Everything's great. Everything's great, everything's great. No, that was wild. I get tight there from traveling. Mm. Like Shana said, it's not the freaking ring. It's like sitting in a plane. Shoulders up to your ears, yeah. There we go. Got the one. Everything feels good? <laughs> I have a tight, thick neck. Everything's good. <laughs> so I'm still good. I'm still here, right? Yeah, I want my neck to be really strong. You feel strong neck? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> that was... This. <laughs> That's very intense. <laughs> I want a strong neck. Raise this leg as high as you can. And now the left one. Feel the same? They feel okay. Yeah. Ooh. A little tight there. Ooh. Yeah, you're compensating because of the groin. What do you think? That side joint's getting me a little. <laughs> he, j he literally just told you. Ooh. Ooh. It's like it's been a long week, okay? Is this what we do for a good time? I don't even know where I am anymore. <laughs> what state are we in? <laughs> Who am I wrestling today? Oh. Does this guy have a hammer? 
This is what we do on a good for a good time. Yeah, in, in, in small towns. Damn it. Options are limited. Where's my vodka? <laughs> Raise that leg again. Where's my vodka? Get back down. He said ice or vodka, I think so. Or Advil. All right, but we have ice. I'll take all three. <laughs> Raise that one again. There we go. Is all right, it? roll on your side facing the whiteboard there. Yeah, let's go this way. Let's go over the edge. I'm just trying to have a good time. Just trying to have a good time. <laughs> She's zombified between the wrestling and the neck work. Do you want me to breathe? Straight up myofascial drunk. Do you want me to breathe? Please, breathing's good. Oh! There we go. <laughs> I'm gonna lose it. She's out of breath. Lay on your back. I am blown up. Keep, keep breathing. Breathing's good. <laughs> Highly recommended. All right, bring this knee up and then down to the outside. Okay. So what was that thing you were saying was on the channel? The bouncing challenge? <laughs> it's a five pound dance. Keep moving that leg. What, wait, what? It... Pick your knee up. Okay. There we go. Ooh, what's that? Oh, Abs what? slash psoas. My psoas. No, oh, psoas. I hate, I hate my psoas. Sick of my psoas. Freaking psoas. Psoas. Oh, when, when you sit a lot. Psoas sucks. So as the seasons go. So as, so as pisses so me as off. the world turns. So as another morning, another flight. You know what? My psoas gets super freaking tight. You get it worked on a lot. I do get it worked on a lot, but I just need a lot of maintenance on it. All right. All right, let's do a decompression now and we'll call it a day oh, for you. Oh, this is exciting. Okay. Oh. Have you seen these? Yes. I already feel better. Good. <laughs> there we go. I can move my legs. Move your legs is good. Okay, that feels better. That 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 um Magnus, Magnus yeah. feels much better. There we go. Magnus feels better. <sighs> lock it up. Yeah. You yep. lock it up. If we're here all night, we're here all night. We're here all night, yeah. Feels yeah. Great. Honestly, good. <laughs> I'm feeling good. This is so, what I call a good night. Let's scoop down that it's way. Just when we get home tomorrow at four, we'll pass the <laughs> We'll wake up right on time on Tuesday. <laughs> when I can work like this one. Yep. Out. Yeah. I love this kind of stuff. Yeah. Scoot down just a little bit that way. Oh, wait, Shana. <laughs> Get over here. Where are you? I'm right what? here. I'm right here. We're all here for you, Ned. We're all here. here for you, Ned. We're all here for you. Come here, hold my hand. Just be brave. It's okay. You're gonna be okay. <laughs> be brave. Are you gonna be all right? Be brave. Everything's good. We good. Everything's gonna be all right. Good. Though, Everything. I'm the I'm tough strong neck. Are we good? You're strong. Hey, settle your tea kettle. Everyone's gonna learn that I'm the tough one in the group. <laughs> You're strong. I'm a baby. Uh, scoot that way just a little bit. Which way? Up towards the... I don't think I can. <laughs> I'm f***ing locked in. Now you're locked in. I'm dropping F-bombs like... <laughs> I'm in... I'm tight. Is that we steal people's wallets. You lock them in, put the wallets I'm in locked the air, in. And then this grab their I... wallet and run out the door because they can't move. That's smart. I'm locked in. Oh. I need one of these. <laughs> I will say my hips feel good. Yeah. I actually love laying in this position, actually. it's It feels really good. Yeah. It's like my sleeping... I want to sleep like this. Is that my tag bar? Yep. No. Nope. Thank you. <laughs> That's my nemesis. Your nemesis. <sighs> nemesis. What's going on? I'm here for you now. What are we doing? Right, you're just going to bite down? With my teeth? Yeah. And then we're going to decompress you. So Go bite, easy. Go bite easy. Down just a little bit. That is great. <gasps> there we go. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What happened? What the <laughs> f happened? <laughs> what happened? I want to know what happened. What, what, what did you do? We decompressed your spine. Is everything good? Everything's good. You promise? <laughs> whoa. Whoa, 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 Everything's good. Everything's good. What, what did you feel? Decompression. What was going on? You're compressed. I was compressed? You compress yourself a lot. You feel like right in the center? I don't know what happened, but I'm... <laughs> I felt that through my soul. Good. <laughs> like the bottom of your shoe, you mean, right? Yeah. Yeah. Was everything crunched up? Crunched. Crunched the yes. fuck up. Crunched the fuck up. Oh my god. It's a technical term. I'm sorry about my swearing, but I'm just gonna drop those at bars. You're good. Swear it away. <sighs> By the moon. And I the wish stars I was holding. I would have literally, if I had known that shit was happening, you I would have had hand. her hold my hand. Yeah, that makes sense. Wow. Turn your head to the left. Raquel, you're gonna have your mind blown. Oh no. <sighs> that came. Like that. Yeah. I've never had that done. Yeah. I don't know what that was. I don't know what that was. I'm not I'm not sure what that was. Yeah, I had it done to me twice and I'm like, yep, I, that's that's the ticket. But you feel good right now? Do you like you feel I, I feel good, but it was de definitely intense. Yeah. 
<laughs> my my spine was all crunched. Yes. <laughs> and now it's not. Extra crunchy. Right. It was original recipe, which is you know. I was literally. What you are now. A Quest bar that was at the bottom of my damn luggage from exactly. like 2018. <laughs> <laughs> what, the cookies and cream? I would say cookie dough. Cookie dough, okay. Look, well, it's a little harder. Makes sense. <laughs> Go ahead and sit up. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm back. And I'm back. And she's back. Oh my God. <laughs> my neck went. Let's, uh, let's stand up right here. All right. All right. <laughs> Are we good though? Everything's good? Both hands go here. Natty. I'm Natty. Yeah. Right here. Mm -hmm. both, both hands here. Beautiful. Uh, uh, Perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. Want me to breathe? Yeah. And look up. Okay. Keep breathing. Oh, you're good there. Okay. okay, okay. All right. Let's sit right here. Holy shit. Yeah. Sorry. That neck thing, that neck thing, I want both of you to understand. I want you both to get that. I've done I've had that done. No, I've, I've never had, had it done. I felt my, done. like, my. Has Matthew done? Ne nobody's ever done that to me. Al ever. Snow was doing this in the back apparently, like 20 years ago. Oh my god! Ryback was telling me that Al Snow was in the back giving people ring dingers. That was wild. <laughs> that neck Nick thing was saying was, that too. Oh my gosh! I feel like he's like, yeah, we're on the road. Nobody's there to help us. We're pulling on each other's necks. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. So you sit up straight. Go hand on hip. Gonna be here. Pull that elbow back hard. So I'm gonna pull straight back. Solid there. Okay, same thing here. And pull. It's all there too. Okay, all right, shake it out. <sighs> that feels great. I, I just that neck thing really freaked me the f out. I'm sorry. I'm just still. I'm emotionally recovering from it. Holy. Sh there you go. I feel great. I just. I, I just. It was like all the pressure was just like. I feel good. I feel really good. It just scared me because it was a lot of noise, and a lot of stuff happening. A lot of decompression. Yeah. So when you fall on your head, that's compression, right? So. Every it's time you land on your head, right? It's yeah. The opposite direction. Thank you so much. So if it's too much, obviously, you know, bones break. And I can do. I can do this now. There we that go. feels good. That feels really good. Because I couldn't do that. Like my groin has been really tight. That Magnus. There it is. Good. Damn it. Enjoy Damn. It. Damn. Damn. Thank you so much. Before you strain it again. <laughs> give you a high five. <laughs> Thank you so much. Before we do it again. Yeah. Wow. 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 That feels good. I feel great. There we go. You ready for me to hold your hand? <laughs>